Right, so question 25 is a question about thirds. Part A, we're asked to rationalize the denominator of 12 over root 3. Now, rationalize means that we are not allowed to have an irrational number in the denominator. So we're going to use a little trick. And we're going to multiply above and below by root 3 which is essentially the same, because root 3 over root 3 is 1. So if I'm timesing it by 1, I'm actually not going to change what's, um, what it's made up of. I'm just going to change the way it looks. A little bit like simplifying a fraction, in a way. Okay, so the top is going to become 12 root 3, and the denominator root 3 times root 3 is 3. And then finally, you're going to have to cancel. 3 goes into 12 four times. So when that cancels into that four times we get four root three for our answer part b we're asked to work at the value of root two times root eight all squared so well that's going to be the same as root two plus root eight times root two plus root eight now, if you're any good at algebra, you should be able to do this. Same idea. Root 2 times root 2 is root 2 squared, which is 2. Root 2 times root 8 is, in fact, root 2 times root 8 is root 16. Root 8 times root 2 is also root 16. And then root 8 times root 8 is going to be 8. Now let's just tidy this up. Root 16 is clearly 4, so we've got 2 plus 4 plus 4 again plus the 8. And tidying up, 2 and 8 is 10, 10 and 8 is 18. And we have the marks for that.